Have you ever wanted to go into the business coaching world, but you're not exactly sure how to do that? One of the biggest objections that I hear is, well, I don't have a successful business or you don't know how to help them with the business side of things, so you don't think you can go in there. Now, what we do here at the Coaching Institute is we teach people about human behavior. Now, that can be applied to the personal world and it can be applied to business. It has a little bit of a different view in business, but what we're doing as business coaches is we're not actually getting in there and helping someone with their finances, for example. What we are doing is we're working with the people and we're working with the structures that are in place to help empower the people. And with what you learn here at the Coaching Institute and especially in the Professional Coach Program, you have the ability to upskill yourself. Maybe you've already got those skills, which is awesome. But if you don't, like when I first came in, I'd never done that before. And I learned the skills through the Coaching Institute to be able to go in and I worked with schools and I worked with different types of companies and I trained people in sales and I did all this stuff that I never thought I could do. But I learned it here at the Coaching Institute. And I wanna share with you a little bit about how we can help you do that. Now, uh, at the end of this video, there's an opportunity for you to click through to a page that we've got set up to find out about the next Pro Coach Rounds Table event where we're actually talking about how to create world leading cultures. So cultures in businesses where people come and they fall in love with what they do. We're, gonna, we're running a training on that. So if you're in Pro Coach, you actually get a ticket to that and I want you in the room. So at the end of the video, click through, there's a link here, you can click somewhere, you can find out more about the, the training that's coming up. So the best model to look at this through is the critical alignment model, which is what is our DNA here at the Coaching Institute. We built this business on the critical alignment model and everything in the school, in every level, we talk about the critical alignment model or you might know it as ESIP. So we've got environment, structure, implementation, people, environment. In a business is things like this, the mission, the vision, the values, right? The attitude, the standards, that is all in the environment. That's the ethos, that's the experience that's gonna be created. And then underneath that, you've got structure. Now structure are things like this, systems, processes, benchmarks, that all goes within structure. Uh, a great example of a business that has great structure is McDonald's. You can go anywhere in the world, you can go to any McDonald's, they're mostly all open 24 hours, most of them are run by uh, 16 year olds, and wherever you go, a Big Mac tastes like a Big Mac. Now, how do they do that? Well, they do that because they have great systems, structures, they have great KPIs, they have great training systems. If your child goes to McDonald's, there's a really good chance that they're gonna be better set up for another job, simply because people know McDonald's has good systems, good training structures. So environment, structure. Implementation is how are those systems actually used? What are they, so you've got the, the structures and the systems and the benchmarks and the KPIs, and then how do you actually do that? That's the implementation of it. And then the last quadrant is people. Who do you have on your team? Who do you have in which role and where do they need to go? And also recruitment fits within P as well. Now, when there's a problem in a business, where do you think most business owners think the solution is? So I'm just gonna ask that again. So when there's a problem in a business, where do you think most business owners think the solution to the problem is? Now, most people think the solution is in people. So it's the people, they're not doing their job properly. I need new people or I need to get a trainer to come in to get the people to be better. But nine times out of 10, the problem actually sits in the environment. It is the fact that there is no agreed upon mission for the business, or there's no, there's no vision, or the company has no values at all, or they have values, but the values are written down on a sheet of paper and no one looks at them, no one actually lives them at all. Or maybe there's no standards. Maybe the standards in the company is, is they have what's called a written ground rule or an unwritten ground rule. So the written ground rule is, is yeah, we all care about this, but as soon as no one's looking, it's like, yeah, we don't give a shit. Most companies have those types of problems and they can be solved by learning about how to help a company set up their vision, their mission, their values, their standards. This completely changes a company. One of the things that makes the Coach Institute a very, very successful business is that we have all of those things. And it's not just that we set them up 16 years ago, we fight for them every single day. We have conversations about them. We have our recruitment is based on our mission, our vision and our values. 
Um, when we have someone come in for a trial, we talk about our values. When we give feedback to someone, it's about our values. We have two meetings every single week that are about our values. So we have a lot of processes in place to make sure that our culture exists and it's growing and it's getting better all the time. Now, I'm sharing this to give some insight into what it actually means to become a business coach, a leadership coach, or an executive coach. This is what you would actually go in and help a business with. And I trust that this is an inspiration for you. Whether you're someone who already wants to do business coaching and, and work with culture improvement, which is such a big industry, and it is such a great idea if you want to become a successful coach, I recommend it. Whether you already want to do it or this is an inspiration for you to start to acquire those skills. I trust that I've served in this really short video. Now, if you wanna know more about how you can become a business coach, a leadership coach, or executive coach, uh, we're putting on a training. It's at the end of the year. It's for our professional coaches. So if you're a professional coach, you get this training. It's part of your course. Um, and it is called Professional Coach Rounds Table. So it's a business development training. It's three days with me and the leaders of the company here. And we're gonna work with you to help you get access to the tools, tips, and strategies that we use to create a winning culture. So you can take that and you can build winning cultures in other people's businesses. So if you wanna find out more or you wanna book in for the training, all you need to do is click the link below. It'll take you to another page. We can book yourself in for the training that's part of your course. I look forward to seeing you on the other side.